I cooked up about 20 to 25 pounds of uh, sugar cake last week, and we're going to go check on the bees and see uh, how much they might take. I already put on about 10 pounds last week, and I have a feeling they've probably eaten it up pretty good. <laughs> So again, I'm going to go right down the line and check basically to see what the sugar stores and pollen cake are like and if the burlap's soaked. Uh, it's now first week of March and uh, a little cooler today, but it's been very warm the last few days and they've been out buzzing and they've been out collecting pollen. I'm hoping that continues. So we'll go right down the line here and see what things are looking like. Although it's kind of hard to say whether this is anything new or whether it's just debris that's being cleaned out from a prior mouse infestation. I'm tending to believe the lather of the two because I'm just not seeing much new stuff. But this is the first hive is the one that uh, might have had mice or might still have mice. I don't think so, though. low activity hive. We'll take a closer peek and make sure they're still going. Yesterday they appeared to be flying. This would be more normal. Some sugar debris from the top and some cappings. So that's a good sign. <clears throat> right off the bat, wet burlap. I packed these guys out with sugar last week. Packed. Uh, cooked up a bunch of sugar cake. And these guys have devoured a lot of it. I see a little bit of pollen cake down here in the corner. Lots of warmth coming up from the hive. I still have some sugar, and that's good. This hive has been very weak. They're not touching the pollen cake. They were out buzzing around yesterday. And I do hear some buzzing from below. Some of the sugar is gone. But the cluster of this hive is very small compared to the others. So we'll see how this goes. As I say, they were out yesterday. And I hear some in there. So they're, they're still in there. But as to whether they have a laying or functional queen, who knows? Sopping wet burlap. Have devoured the sugar cake. Devoured the pollen cake. And that's one week. Um, halfway between these two videos, I cooked up about 20 pounds and uh, put it in the hives and they're they're just eating it down and they're eating the pollen cake good sign this board is absolutely soaked and the burlap inside is absolutely soaked now what does that tell us well since they aren't on wet feed yet it tells me that they've been bringing in nectar and evaporating it uh, because there's just not that much water that could come from anything else. Again, I packed these guys out. They've devoured the pollen cake, pretty much, and devoured most of the sugar. Uh, so, I'm gonna have to be putting more sugar on these guys real soon. If I don't first switch over to wet feed, but. So looking at these guys, they've consumed almost all of the pollen cake, most of the sugar. And I packed these guys out with sugar last week. The burlap was sopping wet, so that indicates they're bringing in nectar from the field, and that's a good thing. I'm going to change the burlap out on that one. These guys, they still have a little pollen cake, a little bit of the sugar. As I said, that was pretty packed out last week, so they're hopping last week. The real question mark is this one here. 
Yesterday was a warm day and they were coming and going from the hive. The burlap is dry. And although there are some bees crawling around, the activity level on this hive is very low. So it, you know, the cluster size I'm sure in here is very, very small. It's a little cool, a little early in the year to be splitting down and going into the, you know, lower super and uh, seeing what's in there. But we'll just have to wish them the best. And honestly, we got six hives and five of them are doing very, very well. One isn't. I can't complain too much, uh, but we'll do what we can for all of them. We may be switching them over to wet feed in the near future because uh, if the warm weather keeps up, hey, then it's time.